Every year in early November, the Model Train Show comes to the Center Progress Building with more displays for both children and adults to enjoy. Jeff Paston, a Junior Junction and Hobby employee, has been involved with this event for many years. This is the 44th show that we have held at the New York State Fairgrounds. The show has attracted uh, thousands of people from the Northeast, from Central New York, even from uh, Southeast Ontario. We get a lot of people in who are interested in model railroads. What makes the Model Train Fair so interesting is the variety of different scales and models they have to see. For instance, the two most popular are the N scale and the HO scale. And you can see how they fit in the palm of my hand very easily. Although model trains have been around for several decades, Jeff stated that not a lot of younger people are getting involved anymore. It's now referred to as a dying hobby. The hobby gives an opportunity to be creative. It's something that's unfortunately lacking today as uh, kids get into electronic devices and uh, cell phones and things that don't require a lot of thinking and creativity. But there's a lot of people who still love selling model trains. Holger Krogman is a local resident who wants to get new people interested. Even if I'm a dealer, you meet the nicest people. It's a happy hobby. You know, people that come to shows, they're happy. They want to spend money on their hobby. You know, and we hope always to interest some new people in the hobby. Many people hope to influence the younger generation to get them involved in creating model trains to keep the hobby strong. In Syracuse, Jeremy Roach on TV Update.